Well, we're more than a few games into the year. How much do we know about this year's rookie class, Grant? Well, it's still early. Completely new group here for the Nuggets. A big group substitution here for Portland. Watford's checked in for Eubanks. Little comes in for Grant. Reddish is checked in for Thibel. And it's Sharp in for Lillard. So the Trail Blazers five right now. Sharp out there with Anthony Simon. Then there's Cam Reddish. Then it's Nasir Little. And it's Watford in at the five. Simon's outside. Six to shoot. There's the triple. The shot comes out. Now Denver takes it the other way. They come into this one having outplayed the Grizzlies last time. And it wasn't necessarily a surprise. They were supposed to win that game, and they did it in an impressive fashion. You always love to see that guys. This team playing to their standards, not playing down to the level of the competition. And year in and year out, there's one thing we know for certain about the Blazers. They've got some of the best fans in the NBA. Let's it go from deep. Reddish misses. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Jackson on the wing. Outside, Green. Pass to MP. Eighteen feet out. And that one off the back of the rim and in. MP's got the second bucket on the night. Yeah, their aggressive approach on the offensive glass has created second-chance opportunities. Ultra-impressive guys caught them off guard, and they've taken the momentum in this game now. Portland again missing. And here are the Nuggets. They're on an 18-7 run. Brown. That basket is good. Off the assist from Jackson. It's impossible to win when you give up second and third chances to score. At some point, guys, it comes down to pride. Start banging on your chest and get after it from your heart. I mean, you've got to at least offer some resistance. You can't just let guys do what they want in there. From deep, MP knocks down the long chain. MP's got eight points. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points. Coming off assists. You know, nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. He got it off in time. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. And so it's the Denver Nuggets. A sizable 18-point lead at the end of the period. They're getting quality look. It's that time of the game, Nuggets fans. With almost an entire new group here. Watford's checked in for Eubanks. Little comes in for Grant. Reddish is checked in for Winslow. And Simon has subbed in for Sharp. Pass to Caldwell Pope. From deep, MP. Can't hit that one. And it's Portland the other way. Their last encounter was in Portland. If they want to beat these guys this time, they have to do better on the glass. That was their undoing. And sometimes that can be a motivating factor. May very well light a fire under them tonight. Nobody likes to be dominated on the glass like that. On the court right now for Portland. Lillard and Simon for the one and the two. And the Sear Little out there with Cam Reddish. And it's Watford in at the center position. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Outside Reddish. Will it go? Gordon pulls it in. Gordon's got four rebounds in the game. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. Be three strong performances throughout this They've really been strong on the glass. 
A challenging stretch for Portland here. And at home for the next game, it'll be Charlotte pulling in to face him. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. Simon shot Simon. is good. You know, this is why you run the offense through Damian Lillard. I mean, sure, he's going to get his, but he's also going to make sure others get theirs, too. From deep, MP. Goes back up. Shot is good by Gordon. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to string together Trending some shots to have any kind of chance. Well, I'd have to say Lillard is one of the game's best passers right now. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Now here's MP. Gordon on the wing. Back to MP. Takes the assist and lays it in. Nice setup. MP's got 10 points. Boy, I like how Gordon dishes the ball. When his teammates are open, he finds them on time and on target. Here's Lillard. Can't get it to drop. Good work defensively by Gordon. Boy, just cannot buy a bucket, guys. I'll tell you what, that's a painful quarter for him, and it's painful for me to watch, too. Yeah, it's called You're Lopo. not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Priority and goal number one has to be tightening up the defense. They can't afford to give him open looks. And so it's Denver. A huge 24 point. 56. Blazers. 32. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters. Substitution will go for a different look here. Bryant, he's checked in for Jokic. Green comes in for Gordon. MP is checked in for Caldwell Pope. And it's Smith in for Murray. Watford's checked in for Portland. Sharp comes in for Thibel. Ish Smith out there with MP. Then it's Thomas Bryant. Then there's Jeff Green. That's the group on the floor for Denver. Back to Lillard. Pass to Simons. Wide open look. The Trailblazers rebound. The shot by Watford. No good. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Puts it up from 12. And another basket from Denver. <laughs> I just love the ball movement. We've gone about three and a half minutes here into the third. Here's Sharp. Back to Lillard. Here's Watford. Pass to Sharp. Shot clock at six. Ooh, they can't stop the run with that one. MP against Simons. From deep, MP. Again, MP missing. And for the Trailblazers, they're shooting a rough 29% from the field here. Another shot. And Grant finishes Jeremy it off. Grant. Grant's got 12 points. Well, I tell you, I think Grant's athleticism was what allowed him to win out there. Smith passes to MP. He tries for three. And score it. That now makes him seven for 11 in this game. Major dominance. It comes so easily for him. Fantastic at getting to his spots on the floor. Pass to Sharp. Here's Simons for three. He can't get it to go. He just keeps firing away from distance. I know he's trying to get himself heated up, but at what cost? From deep, MP. Denver the rebound. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Bryant's got his second basket. And there he is. I mean, attacking the boards, converting off the misses. I mean, trying to do everything he can to secure this W. Well, he enjoys deflating the opposition with those extra possessions. And so it's Denver. Holding a massive 34-point lead to end the quarter. Defense is setting the tone. Back to the game.
in for Bryant. MP comes in for Brown. And it's Smith in for Jackson. A big group substitution here for Portland. Eubanks, he's checked in for Watford. Grant comes in for Little. Simons is checked in for Reddish. And Damian Lillard subbed in for Johnson. You know, some have said those old school power forwards, guys like Charles Oakley, they're becoming outdated. You see that, Grant? Well, first of all, the physicality in the game is no more. The way Oakley would hit you and bruise you, you can't do that in today's game. And guys like Oakley are now playing the five position and they're shooting three pointers. So a lot of it just is because the game has changed and evolved since the 90s when Oakley dominated. Smith. Great skill level in the game right now. No question. Taking a look at the Trailblazers. Lillard and Simons are the one of the two. And for just Simons. as Winslow out there with Jeremy Grant. And it's Eubanks in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Really hard to think of things they didn't do well in this one. Certainly a dominant night on offense for the Nuggets. Well, Grant, I don't know if there was one deciding factor in this game, but I'd say shooting accuracy if I had to choose. Agreed, B.A. They really went after quality looks and shot the ball with confidence. And so they'll chalk up another win and put themselves at 31 wins on the year. It's just a great matchup for them. And they're looking for the four-game season sweep in their next meeting. They really do. I mean, there's one more game to play in this season series, and barring any yeah, major change to their team, I have to believe the sweep will be in order. And what a huge performance it was for Nikola Jokic. You look forward to playing with someone who doesn't just move the ball, but moves it with a purpose. And here's Simons outside. Denver grabs the miss. At this point, I'm not sure if it's the play calling or the player himself. MP finds Green. Now Smith, defended by Lillard. Hey, puts up a three. And MP with the three. Hey, guys, that's got to be the dagger. This is how you finish a game. Yeah, what a time to put the hammer down. Any hope of a comeback? Diminished. Pass to Eubanks. To halt the run. Rebounded by Green. Smith passes to MP. Launches a three. No good. So it's the Nuggets winning this one easily. Well, this might not have been the most competitive game we've ever seen, but you've got to appreciate their masterful performance. And I'm sure their fans appreciated it, too. We saw the outstanding defense and a loaded offensive effort. And they were just dominant out of the game. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Grant Hill, Mark Kellogg, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. So long,